Finally tonight, it's mid-July, and for area berry farms, that means it's prime berry picking season. Our Josh Peterson visited a berry farm that offers a wide variety and unique type of berries. Every summer around the second week of July, there is a movement that takes place. A movement where berry picking enthusiasts turn out by the bucket loads to pick this natural summer treat. Just a half mile southeast of Bagley, the Honeyberry Farm is booming with berries of all kinds. What is unique about this farm is what the farm offers. Well, we have honeyberries and cherries, sour cherries, and we're like the only place in Minnesota that has a honeyberry you pick. And we also sell these plants. Everything that we grow, we sell. For this recently new family farm, it's a labor of love, bringing new types of berries to the area, as well as the knowledge. The Honeyberry Farm is not only a pick-your-own farm, but a nursery as well, expanding their offerings to those who want to try their hand at berry farming. Uh, they're a smaller bush, a rounder berry, and they've combined them with Russian genetics, so it's the same species. It's a honeysuckle species, non-invasive honeysuckle that produces delicious blueberries. Another unique aspect about this pick your own farm is that this farm is all natural. No herbicides or pesticides are used, reassuring each picker that they are getting the best and healthiest berry that they can pick. Well, we just, we believe in healthy living and we don't want to tarnish our land with sprays and herbicides and, and technically we're not, we're not classified organic, but we can say we're, we're naturally grown and herbicide free. With endless rows of berries ranging from honeyberries, tart cherries, currants, elderberries, sea berries, raspberries, and much more. With berry picking in prime season right now, the Honeyberry Farm is ready for berry pickers of all ages. With this week's Northwoods Adventure in Bagley, I'm Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.